in hindsight, I thought I was never going to, you know, talk about another mishap from a Bulgarian Bostonian American named Turkey Tom or Tom Swanson as it is apparently his real name once again in 2023 at least three years later but here we are and that's one of the reasons why I wanted to talk about Turkey Tom again uh, this year and this was the only video I made of him this year so far because he did uh, a stupid thing in my which got him some controversy at least he was making a joke I put in quotation marks for a reason because I don't think it's a joke but he was making a joking tweet about him watching video of Moist Critical who did not actually upload that type of video talking about the Israel drama I also put that in quotes because it is not drama it is a war and Turkey Tum decided to fool the morons who were ultimately duped by his tweet and the morons I'm talking about have every right to be mad at Turkey Tom for this because they have every, every right to be mad at Moist Critical for this but some people were actually mad at Turkey Tom for at least making a fake t screenshot tweet and by fake screenshot I mean Photoshop tweet Photoshop uh, screenshot of a video that Moist Critical did not actually talk about. Because knowing Moist Critical, he does not have the knowledge to talk about such things like this. That's why he keeps it in the internet. And he's pretty much good at talking about the internet only, which is why I thought Turkey Khan was being disingenuous by tricking people who thought it was real. Like, he thinks it was funny now when he made this stupid joking tweet. As I put the word joking in quotes again because it's not a joke. But clearly, that tweet he made was distasteful and disgraceful at best. Like, I get it. If you're bored, you have to make a shit post of a tweet. But just because you have to make a sh shit post of a tweet doesn't mean you need to make fun of what's going on in the war. Like, would he do that? Would he do the same thing to the Palestinians? Or the country Palestine? Would he do the same thing? I mean, I hope not, but he might. Like, making fun of what happened to Israel on October 7th is not funny. It's not hilarious at all. I mean, regardless how you feel about Turkey Tom, just know that this tweet should not have been in ignited in the first place. Because he ignited a conversation that many people have fallen for. And I thought I was one of those people too. But I eventually checked Moist Critical's actual video with the actual timestamp of that video of how long it was. Correction time duration of the video. But anyway. Turkey Tom should not have made a joking tweet out of this. What he should have done is learn about the 
Israel and Palestine conflict. Instead of tweeting about Moise Whitaker allegedly making a video on Israel, which again he was not making a video on that, and Tucky Tom just decided to make a funny meme out of it, which I have to say this again, it's not funny at all. I think it was disingenuous and unprofessional for him as a commentary YouTuber to, you know, make fun of something that is actually serious because what happened on October 7th, 2023 involved concert goers who were killed by Hamas, which then st started making Israel declaring the war in, in, in like the next few days after. And unfortunately for Turkey Tom, I think there's this one guy who's going to give him something that unfortunately does not involve you know, getting something under the tree that made him seem that he was a good person. When in fact, what he did is a naughty, naughty thing to do. Oh, oh, oh. We meet again. Mr. Swanson, if that is even your real name, you once again were, are, are right, aren't you? You can never stop being bad, huh? Well, clearly, this isn't. This being a good boy isn't working out for you after all these years. Like, I am so sorry, but I have no other choice. You're on a naughty list again for these various reasons. And for those various reasons, I cannot give you a present this year. Joking about what happened in, in another country by making a fake photoshop of a video will immediately put you on this year's naughty list and you know what that means for Boys who are not who are on the naughty list. Yeah, that's right. Call and you get while on your stocking this Christmas. Have a great December, Tom. Look, I'm all for jokes and all that. And I'm all for trolling as well. But you kind of do it in a way that, in my opinion, doesn't involve, you know, making people actually pissed off because there is a certain war going on between the two countries right now. If you're going to make a joke about Israel, don't do that on the day after its civilians get attacked by a Palestinian militant group of all people. And you most definitely shouldn't be photoshopping Moist Critical's video. I think that was too far.
Like, I'm not defending those who got mad at Turkey Tom because they didn't take at least a minute or two to go and find the real video with that uh, time duration of the original video that Moist Critical made. But at the end of the day, there is a time and a place for doing su such a thing like this. Maybe don't make the Photoshop thing about Israel. Make it about something else. Just please stick to trolling about internet things.